Welcome to Rocky Mountain RV and the all new Bighorn 2011 3670 RL by Heartland, the gold standard in luxury fifth wheels. Let's walk around the outside of this coach and take a look. In the front end here we have unbelievable storage as well as space for a generator if you so wish to opt it. We also do have hydraulic front landing gear operated by a switch in this area right here. We do have hitch lights down here as well and an ABS hitch cover to cover up that big pin box. <clears throat> Our front cap on the Bighorn is specially designed, aerodynamically correct, and cut to make an 88 degree turn even on a short bed pickup without a sliding fifth wheel hitch. This is a Heartland exclusive. In our first compartment door, we house our hydraulic pump that operates not only our slide outs but our front landing gear as well, as well as our battery systems. These doors are made of all aluminum with a slam baggage latch uh, inspired by the motorhome industry. <clears throat> our basement storage is also a slam baggage latch with gas props that hold up the door. With a huge amount of storage as well as lights underneath, you can see how much storage you actually get. Our belly compartment is made with the Space Saver chassis to allow for more storage by dropping the frame rails below the compartment and gaining us that extra height. We're also covered with, with, a, with a tough ply flooring as well as tie down rings in the compartment to allow those those loads not to slip around. As we come back we feature a four step entry step making that entry into your coach a little easier as well as aluminum alloy wheels. <clears throat> this coach is the only coach that features a laminated floor with block foam insulation. This gains a strength as well as uh, weight savings. Our roof is also laminated. With this sample you can see that we're five and a half inches thick in the center, full block foam insulation. Again, very strong, very lightweight. We also feature the trail air suspension. This allows for a less bumpy ride, not having your items bounce around in the coach as you go down the road. Our tires are 16 inch, 10 ply, and again on alloy aluminum wheels. <clears throat> As we come around the back of the coach, you can see that our rear cap is also fiberglass and molded to make for better aerodynamics as well as a great look. On the off door side here, you can see that our rear electric jacks add extra stabilization with just the push of a button right here underneath this control panel. Our power cord is a 50 amp service. It allows us to pull out the core here as well as reel it back in with an electric reel. And anyone that's dealt with any of these any of these large cords on a cold day knows that that reel is invaluable. Another Heartland exclusive. As you see, Heartland also features an easy dump system. This allows us to keep the sewer hose right connected to the sewer connection as well as easily open up and dump into our, into our dump sites. right over and into your dump site, easy as can be. This is the other side of our storage compartment. It also houses our docking station. This features all of our, our connections, our water hookups, as well as our satellite and, uh, and phone connections. We do have a light in here as well, allowing us to do anything out here at night. Our winterized suction valves are out here. Waste holding valves as well. This little compartment right here opens up so we can see this from the outside. And as you can see our hoses and everything will drop right through here 
and then we can go ahead and close our door right over the top so we don't have hoses out here in our walkway when you walk around the coach. Another Heartland feature. Our propane tanks are housed here. Uh, we carry two 7-gallon, 35-pound propane tanks, and again, in a slam baggage latch compartment door. Let's go ahead and step up in this coach, and I'll show you the interior of the 3670RL Bighorn. As you enter into the interior, you can see that everything is very well lit and a great amount of space. As we walk to the back of the coach, we'll start with the living room. <clears throat> we use two high boy swivel rocker recliners with uh, a leather cover. Over to our side here, we have our desk. Uh, we'll accommodate a, a PC as well as a laptop. Next to it, we do have our electric fireplace. Up above in the cabinet there we have our LCD TV, HD capability, and over to the side here our cabinet that houses our surround sound box uh, as well as AM FM CD player. <clears throat> over on this side is our leather sofa. This does also make an air height -a bed sofa. It folds out and an air, air bladder blows up to, uh, to give you one extra bed in your coach. As you look throughout our coach, all of our cabinets throughout do feature full hardwood and not only just the cabinet doors but all of our styles as well. All the wood here as well as at the end of our bar here is all actual hardwood hand finished and stained. As we come up into our dining room you'll see our freestanding dinette with the four padded back chairs. This is one of the features of Bighorn that you don't see in many other coaches. We do have storage both built into our chairs right down in here, as well as an add -a leaf table. It gives us a little bit extra room when we are sitting four full-size adults at the table. Overhead lighting fixtures over the dinette as well as the sofa, and then some reading lights put back in above the cabinets there. We also have some reading lights over above the, the rear recliners. And you will notice that all of our ceiling lighting is recessed into the ceiling just like any of your new homes. <clears throat> right above my head here is a paddle fan as well as a light. Helps us just circulate a little bit of the warm air from the fireplace back here in the living room. In our kitchen, you'll see ample storage throughout, as well as true solid surface countertops built by Hanex. We have a pull-out sprayer on our faucet for both hot and cold, making those dishwashing jobs a little easier. Under these covers here you'll see that we do have full stainless steel sinks that are sunken. Uh, and again, these are full solid surface countertops. No fakes and, uh, and no molded tops here in the Bighorn. In the 3670 we actually have the largest kitchen of any fifth wheel on the market. It allows us to have this extra little workspace over here as well as our full L kitchen. And of course all of these do have cabinet doors, full storage underneath in here as well over on that side and one of the bighorn features that I find really great is right here in the end we have a hidden lazy Susan that opens up for a little bit of extra storage all of the drawers in the in the bighorn feature ball bearing rollers and full extension we're full plywood drawers and these are uh, all jointed together and you can see here are full extension ball bearing roller guides In the stove area, the stove is sunken into the countertop, so when we do lay down our stove cover, it lays nice and flat with the top of the countertop, allowing us to have a little extra workspace. The Bighorn features a full-size residential microwave, giving us the maximum cooking space for this size of coach. Moving over to the refrigerator, we run the largest double-door refrigerator on the market. This is a 9 cubic foot Dometic. It does allow us to have more cabinet space because we are only two doors on this refrigerator but almost as much space as your side-by-sides. The freezer does feature the ice maker as well. Over in this cabinet here 
we have our pull-out pantry, allowing us easy access to any of our groceries that we stow away in that cabinet. And of course another shelf pantry above it. You can also see that we have hidden hinges on all of our cabinet doors in the Bighorn, and again, full hardwood cabinets. Underneath the refrigerator, we have a full-size pot and pan drawer, again with stainless steel ball bearing roller guides to allow us for some extra heavy pots and pan storage, that type of thing. As well as over underneath our, our stove, we also have another full-size, full-extension pot and pan drawer. The Bighorn 3670 does feature a closet as you come in the door, both for brooms and for jackets. Our control panels are all hidden away behind this door. These are our slide-out switches, our electric awning switch, our interior lights, exterior lights, as well as our electric water heater, ceiling fan, and awning receptacle. And Bighorn does put this awning receptacle switch in here, so you can have lights on the outside and plug them into the outside of the coach and turn them off from the inside. And you can see that we do have that here in the showroom. As we start up towards the bedroom, both of our steps have a storage drawer that pull out. Again, something you only see in your extra Highline fifth wheels. And as we make our way up here, you can see that we do have a full hard swing door which is wood with a glass insert to enter into our bedroom. No curtains, nothing like that in this type of coach. Come on into the bedroom here, you can see that we have a king size bed, and this is a full pillow top. Three and a half inches of foam on the top of this mattress. And then our inner spring underneath it. Give us that comfy night's sleep when we're out there on the road. Up to the front of the bedroom here we have our full size closet. Bighorn has the only actual walk-in closet in the market with the built-in shoe racks here in the front. We also do have lighting as well to give us a little bit of extra view when we're looking for those clothes. Over to the side here we have our washer dryer prep. This will take a stackable washer dryer unit in this particular model, and you can see we're all ready to go. If you choose not to put a washer dryer in, we do have a hanging clothes rod here so this space is not wasted. We still can use it as a closet. At the foot of the bed, you'll see a six drawer dresser, and even in the bedroom, Bighorn does feature the full stainless steel ball bearing roller guides. We do have full TV hookups and capability in the bedroom as well, as well as many other closets, small nooks. As we come into the bathroom, you'll see the bathroom has dual entries, one from the bedroom and one from the hallway. <clears throat> We feature a porcelain toilet in this particular coach. And again, this is just going to make life a little bit easier when it comes to cleaning and longevity of the, of the, of the unit. We do also feature a solid surface countertop in the bathroom area, as well as storage below, a medicine cabinet above with a vanity. And one of the best features on the Bighorn is the seamless shower stall. This is a one-piece molded fiberglass shower stall. You can see that it does not have a seam top to bottom. A little bit more expensive to put in this coach, but very worthwhile. Most things on the market will have uh, a shower pan at the bottom that is ABS plastic, and then a very thin shower surround, which we have seen a lot of trouble with in the industry with cracking and cold weather. We haven't had one issue with the seamless fiberglass stall from Bighorn. You can see we also have adjustable uh, adjustable hand sprayer on the uh, on the shower as well as a soap tray there. And a little bit of storage above the above the toilet as well. So once again, that's our Bighorn 3670 RL 
2011 model built by Heartland RVs. I appreciate your time, and this is Nathan Hubbard for Rocky Mountain RV. Please come in and visit us. Our phone number is 1-800-822-1114, or you can visit our website at rockymtnrv.com. Thank you again.